A. We all know pressure is exerted by fluids. To understand that how pressure varies in a fluid with height, I have devised a very simple activity wherein I have just taken a small bottle and at the starting from the base of the bottle, I have made three to four holes, very narrow bricks. And while I have made these bricks, they are at different separation from the, from the base of the bottle. That means when I'm going to pour in water in the bottle, water is going to come out due to the fluid pressure from each of the bricks. But we will see the range of water through each brick will be different. The one which is at the bottom will reach the farthest. And the one which is at a greater height will reach closer to the base of the bottle. So let's go. Let's see. So I open the bottle, start filling it with the fluid that is the simple clean water from the tap. Let's see what happens. As you can see, there are different streams of water coming from each of the bricks I created. And this one that is at the base is covering the maximum range and one at the top is covering the minimum. Let me show you once more. I refill it. Streams of water are coming out. This one covering the maximum range and on the top it's lesser range means pressure varies with height. Thank you.